Hey folks, it's Rich here. Um, I just wanted to uh, talk about a couple of things that I'm quite excited about at the moment. Um, I don't go out much, so these things are really exciting to me. Um, well, the first thing, uh, really, is um, I work in an office at the moment during the day, and you know there are times where I don't get to play guitar as much as I'd like to, and you know I'm not stressing about the the calluses on the fingertip. Um, so, you know, and also because. Um, for a long time I've kind of had like a bit of a weakness between these two fingers here you know and um, it didn't help the fact that I, I you know I once had an accident where I knocked that knuckle quite far back into the hand but you know that's another story uh, so yeah I uh, a few years ago I bought one of these things uh, it's a, a grip master um, it's purely just designed you know to work the fingers you can do them individually blah 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 but uh, one of the things I found is it never really dealt with the calluses on the fingertips. But then a couple of weeks ago, uh, I actually discovered these things. Now, um, see these black caps on the top here? They're actually attachments that go on to the uh, the grip master. That's what it looks like normally. I don't know if you can see here, but see there's actual ridges on that. They're actually serrated, and they just clip onto the top of the grip master, um, and of course you push your fingertips into them and it hurts like a son of a bitch for a while but then I don't know if you can see you see the lines it leaves on the fingertip um, but actually it has done wonders for my calluses I've been using it for a couple of weeks now you know I just sit in the office well <sighs> got a free moment with the hand and just sit do this and uh, you know I've noticed a m massive difference to my playing recently is just because the fingertips are, are so much firmer now there is a lot more tone uh, and sustain coming out the the string, so I can't recommend that enough. It's been a lifesaver, uh, as far as I'm concerned. But the other thing that I discovered recently uh, in my my colleague's home office is one of these. Now, it is effectively just a guitar neck, a disembodied guitar neck. Uh, it's called a shred neck. Uh, there's the logo there, um, and it is designed purely as a warm up practice tool. Um, I actually bought it for the office so that well. I have a free moment, you know, I could just sit and just do some finger exercises. Um, you know, it's, it's pretty good for that kind of thing. Uh, and it's it's got padding. It's actually upside down compared to a normal guitar. This is the top. Um, the uh, the headstock actually designed to sit on your thigh. So you could just sit like this. Believe it or not, it actually has strap locks as well. Um, this has been fantastic. It doesn't really play any tune. I mean, you can, you can try and tune it, but it, it doesn't really sound so great, you know. That's that's the, that's the best you get from it, but because they're actual proper guitar strings and everything's properly spaced, you know it's great just to sit and do exercises. Uh, you know, not really looking to to achieve a great tone from it. So I, I'm really pleased with this, and I can't recommend this enough, especially if you're like me. You know, you you uh, you're a part-time musician, uh, guitar player in the evening, and. Uh, I'm actually going to take this away with me. I'm going to be travelling to America very shortly, so I'm going to take this on holiday with me. Um, and if I get a free moment, you know, I can just sit and keep on top of things. So, let me go through this again. This is called a Shred Neck. Um, I actually bought this from the Guitar Centre website. It had to be shipped from America, but it was the best place I found it. And the reason why I got the Jason Becker model is because um, of the three different varieties they sold on the Guitar Centre website, I preferred this colour. And also Jason Becker's pretty cool. Um, yeah, the Grip Master is completely separate from these Rough Rider caps. The Rough Rider caps are about four pounds. Uh, I think that's that's roughly the uh, currency conversion. The Grip Master itself was about ten pounds. Uh, this is a medium tension one. You actually to get uh, uh, a tougher version than this is is black. So you know if you've already got pretty strong fingers, then this is quite good. Uh, so yeah, go out and buy them. Um, and on that note, I'll leave you to it. Bye.